This demonstration shows the physical topology features of Contrail Analytics. These features are built on top of the Contrail Analytics platform that takes in flow information, operational state information, and log information from the control nodes and compute nodes in the Contrail system, and also takes in information from physical nodes via SNMP and flow information via SFlow and IPFIX. All these kinds of information are exposed via REST APIs. This physical topology feature is but one of features that can be built using these APIs. Let's go in and look at the topology of the system we have here. As you can see in this topology, we have these physical nodes. We also show the links between the nodes. You can go in into any of these links and see the interfaces on either side. You can also see the traffic statistics for either side of this link. We can go in and look at details of these nodes. We can go into these nodes that have V routers hanging off of them and look at details of the V routers themselves, including the VMs that hang off of these V routers. So this is a good overall view of the topology in question. And let's look at some of the other features that are offered. One of the features offered is to look at the overlay flows that exist on the network via an active tracing mechanism. So let's uh, go and look at the flows we have. Now we can see the flows based off of any V router in the system or any VM in the system. Before we do that, let's look at the application that runs on the system. We have a Redmine server here talking to a MySQL database in the back end and the server is being accessed by a client. So going back to our topology, we can go and search for all the flows on the Redmine server VM. So here's the Redmine server VM. And these are its flows. So it's good to look at these flows. Uh, what we really want though is to look at the path that they take in the physical network. So let's go ahead and choose one of these flows and try to map it. Now this shows what path these flows take via the network from the source to the destination with all of the nodes that are along the way. Of course, along with these nodes, you can see all the links and the interfaces that are traversed. Now that was one flow. This flow goes via MX80-2. Let's look at some other flow here as well. And let's try and map it. Now this flow goes through a different path we do have ECMP in the system, so you can see all the individual paths taken by all the flows. Now this is one feature, this is to see all the active flows in the system now. Now in addition to this, we also have the capability of looking at historical information. We do ingest information via SFlow and IPFIX from physical nodes. We can choose what flows we're looking for. So let's go ahead and choose flows from that same VM we were looking at from that virtual network that go into the front end into the Redmine server. And let's run the query. Now these are the flows that were seen. We can also go into any of these flows and see what path they actually took. So this is the path that this flow took. You can see that this um, information is now available on a historical basis as well. This concludes our demo. It is possible to build other applications as well on top of the REST APIs offered by the Contrail Analytics platform. And this is one small example of what is possible. Thank you for your attention.